Can you not drive at all? I know. No, but do you know how? <laughs> well, I've seen people do it. I don't... I don't <laughs> but you don't, have a you don't have a licence. What? You don't have a licence? No. OK. You can't drink and drive, so what's the point? <laughs> well, that's, that's kind of... Once upon a time in Hollywood, nearly three hours long, Leonardo DiCaprio attended the premiere, and by the end, his date was too old for him. So... <laughs> you'll, you'll be pleased to know this is the last time I'm hosting these awards, so... I don't care anymore. Um, I'm joking. I never did. Um, on a serious note, just looking at all the faces here reminds me of some of the great work that's been done this year by cosmetic surgeons. Um, <laughs> the next presenter is an award-winning actress with special powers. In Die Another Day, she used her powers of seduction to win over James Bond. In X-Men, she used her powers to control the elements. In Catwoman, she used the power of being able to wash herself all over. And <laughs> she's the paw for behind the ear. It's brilliant. Please welcome the very clean Halle Berry. <laughs> All female remakes are the big thing. There's a female remake of Ghostbusters. There's going to be a female remake of Ocean's Eleven. And this is brilliant for the studios, because they get guaranteed box office results, and they don't have to spend too much money on the cast. So... <laughs> Shut up, I don't care. Our next presenter is an actress who is both beautiful and talented. Born in England, she came to America and has taken Hollywood by storm. The star of the nominated movie, The Danish Girl, please... It's a dude. Eddie Redmayne. I love this next presenter. He's so cool. Um, he's the star of Iron Man. Two girls and a guy. Wonder Boys. Sorry, are these porn films? What? <laughs> kiss, kiss, bang, bang. <laughs> Bowfinger. Really? <laughs> yeah. Up the Academy. Come on. He has done all those films, but many of you in this room probably know him best from such facilities as the Betty Ford Clinic and Los Angeles County Jail. Please welcome Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> Chocolate bar. It's a delicacy in Sweden. Um, how... Aren't foreigners funny? <laughs> so how would you advertise it? How would you sit there and munch? If it's a Swedish advert, it would be a really weird one, wouldn't it? It would be something like, mm. you better the plup. Oh, the plup. Flip the bed of plup. Ooh. You like soups, don't you? Yeah, yes. yeah. OK, so it's a cock flavoured bouillon. <laughs> cock flavour. Excellent. Oh, God. <laughs> Slurp it up. The great taste of cock. <laughs> And, and now that you're older, mm. is it, has it occurred to you again, have you given any more thought to God and whether he might be real? Uh, yeah, I think about it every day. Yeah? Yeah, he's not. <laughs> I know, but you look so calm. I know, but I had some of your heroin. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering where I put that. Oh, oh look, it's a ginger Frankenstein. <laughs> I, 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 you know, do you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Uh, you're 65 this Thursday, aren't you? That's correct, yes. You can't use this till Thursday. This is official. I got you a bus pass and senior citizens. <laughs> oh, it's a Metro card. There it is. <laughs> no, they, they, they ask me a lot of the time in the press, why don't you have children? Which is a really odd question to ask someone, why don't you have children? Yeah. As opposed to asking people, why do you have <laughs> yeah. children? Do you know what I mean? It's like... <laughs> We are now, we're on TBS. Right, I've never, I've never heard of that. Yeah, no, it's, right. it's a growing concern. Okay. It's really, in, in 30 years, we're going to be... What channel, what number on the dial? Well, if it depends uh, what oh. medium you're using. Yeah. Uh, direct TV would be uh, 247. 247. 247. <laughs> who, who finds it? They must, they, they, they're definitely, they're definitely looking for porn, if they find this. I just, I just I... feel like I'm... I'm not long for this world. Oh, well, you, you're fine. My nan, my nan used to say that. My nan said that for about 20 years. She used to say, oh, I won't see Christmas, right? Yeah. She was right eventually. Yeah, obviously. well... <laughs>
<laughs> well, the last, the last one. Eventually, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, what constitutes the world, Ricky Gervais? When you say world tour, well, I, like I, in America, we have the World Series, but it's just us fighting Exactly. Us. And same as Mr. Universe, always comes from Earth. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Um, so, it's a fix. Yeah. You look pumped, buffed, and cut. <laughs> you, I mean, you, you are ready to go. Thank you. When, when did this happen, for God's sakes? Um, it's been a gradual process. Yeah. Well, what over, is your goal? Over uh, 50 years. Uh-huh. Started off really small. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, what's the big... matter with your voice? Oh, I've got a sore throat. Oh. So that's, that's it. How long have you had the sore throat? Just a couple of days. See, now I had a sore throat and, uh, uh, around the holidays. It's all and about I just... you, isn't it? It's all about uh, you. It... <laughs> <laughs> if we're out or something, I, I, I sort of like lag behind and get Jane by herself with no one on, and I take a picture of her and I tweet Jane with all her friends. <laughs> yeah. So, and this is always a so like, bit, imagine. So, so. Yeah. I... Here, here's one you tweeted of Jane. Jane thinking about making new friends. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I mean, Jane, look at those crows. <laughs> <laughs> but does she not know you're doing it? Does no, she not, not think, where time. is he, she, where is he? She sees the tweet. <laughs> uh, this, Jane thought she'd made a new friend, but it was just a shadow. <laughs> uh, yeah. Which is the next one? Just found this photo of Jane when she was little. <laughs> Jane is looking so happy because her new friend hasn't walked away yet. <laughs> Ricky Gervais couldn't be here tonight, so instead we're going to give this to our friend Steve Carell. Look at his stupid face. <laughs> Have you even been to see Ghost Town yet? No. I sat through Heaven Almighty. Give me my Emmy. <laughs> Give me my Emmy. I'll come down there. <laughs> <laughs> Give me it. <laughs> I'll tickle you. I don't care. I've got nothing to lose here. I'm a nobody here. Where is it? <laughs> yes, you have. Stop. Yes, you have. Yes, you have. Give me it. Give me the Emmy. <laughs> Give me the Emmy. <laughs> Give me the Emmy. <laughs> Give me it. <laughs> Give me the... Thank you. <laughs> Right. Good. That's settled. Uh, these are the nominees for directing for a variety, music or comedy programme. Right. Our next presenters are two of the funniest people in America. She stole the show on Saturday Night Live, then went on to create, write and star in her own show, 30 Rock. He was a jobbing actor, career not going that well, if I'm being totally honest, who, who got his big break when I cast him in a remake of a show that I created called The Office. He's now leaving that show and killing a cash cow for both of us. Please welcome the wonderful Tina Fey and the ungrateful Steve Carell! <laughs> I never knew you were this weird. Really? Because <laughs> no, you, you kept it. You, we we yeah. worked together for a couple of days. And did, I know. You're absolutely mental. <laughs> in a, in a nice way. Yeah. 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 But the, so. <laughs> the town in Minnesota has cancelled plans to change the name of a street called Stoner Avenue. <laughs> it's a weird street. And instead of saying stop, all the signs say chill, bro. Sorry, 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 uh, sorry, sorry. Um, yeah, you're not, you're, you're, not, still... you're not giving them, you know, they come out, <laughs> they, they park their cars, they've got babies that they haven't paid, why would you? That'd be mental. <laughs> but, but if I was you, I'd be going, thank you so much, these people, and giving them, you know what I mean? Yeah, it was, but I'm not doing it. It was shoddy. It was, um, I mean, you, you know, you, you didn't write it, and that's, but do it like, <laughs> but, 
Do it like it's your own. Do it like you were clever enough to come up with this joke yourself. <laughs> okay. <laughs>